here's what I'll do. I'll, I'll, I'll elaborate on it. Just because you can't see the art museum footage, or no, wait. All right, you can see it. Fine, that's the Christ Spirit, the Holy Spirit. It opens up your spiritual eyes to, to grasp it. If you can see the deception in the sky, it's the Christ Spirit opens up your spiritual eye to be able to see the deception, the, you know, whatever, whatever all this is, fluff. It's just a bunch of fluff. To be able to see anything that is deception is obviously the Christ Spirit. Now, just because you can't see it doesn't mean you don't have the Christ Spirit. How's that, John? Because there's people in this world I assume they have the Christ Spirit in them. If I go and try to show them the art museum footage and they just don't see it, I can't beat them over the head and make them see it and make the Christ Spirit appear inside of them because only Christ can actually reveal that, the truth. The devil deceives you Christ reveals you. Reveals the things that are hidden. So, it's not that people are, uh, they're going to burn in hell because they can't see the art museum footage and, and what it means. Because you can still see it. You can see things, similarities, lining up, lining up, lining up. And you can constantly, you can, you're, not you in particular, but your mind naturally, even my mind was naturally trying to look at something that didn't line up as I was doing side-by-side -side comparisons. And all it did was it, it confirmed it over and over and over. So it's a concrete, solid, no question about it, that it's this exact footage. Considering I can't explain how, but yet there are some people out there that seem like they know the future. Like Jacob Israel is obviously one of them. Whether he's doing it for good intentions or not, I still have a... a I don't have a good feeling about it. About, you know, showing me around. Even though it's, like, amazing, it's miraculous, but, you know, sorcery and wizardry is miraculous and amazing also. The sky itself, it's just not my thing. I don't know. It just, it's not my niche. I'm not really interested in looking at it because how much it, it, it like how many how much what does it mean anyway if it, if the stuff is in the sky you got triangles and numbers and letters is there some kind of message up there to give you the powerball number cuz other than that it's basically the same as art museum footage yeah well what's the what where, where is it going to get you? Where does it get me to show it over and over and over again? It's not like somebody's just going to come and hand me a bunch of money like you two. Bono's not just going to show up one day and just hand me my check for all the royalties checks that, that I should get. Because it, it, it's, a, it's a time difference. It's literally impossible to prove that in a court of law on earth. 
And that's the difference between earth and, and spirit realm. I can prove it in spirit for sure, but at what point does the spiritual court rule in my favor and then the physical literal currency is deposited into my bank account? I guess that's when heaven will be brought down to earth. Because I can't imagine life going all the way, however much longer I live in the flesh, if it's 30 years from now, I can't imagine living those 30 years never being compensated for that. It just doesn't make sense. Because then what's the, what's the point of any of it, really? To just show that my footage was used? All right, yeah, it's an honor. It's an honor that, even though it's a, so ridiculous, because... The devil still t tries to tell me how ridiculous it sounds. I already know how ridiculous it sounds. But you know it's true. So shut your face. Right? That's how I talk to myself. In my head. Or out loud. Whatever. But it's true. It's, it's so 100% dead on. That I went to the art museum. Recorded. Played eight songs of U2. One after another after another. And every single song of their video, even though they didn't even have videos playing when I was doing the recording, the song itself, but when I link the video, because what happened was the Holy Spirit is like a teacher and a, someone that gives you a little nudge, like, yo, go check out, do it side by side now. Take that song, go take, go look at their video and play it side by side. Link it to the exact time that you were playing it and see if anything lines up. Of course it does, it all lines up. It kept doing it. So for the, the regular person that's walking this earth that already has the Christ spirit in them, I go and say that and show it to them and they can't see it. I can't say that they don't have Christ in them. And that's, that was my point with don't link me to saying that if you can't see it, you don't have the Christ spirit. No. If you can't see it, it means Christ didn't reveal it to you. At some point, he may. Like, when, when did you finally realize that what I'm saying is dead on accurate? That you too, you know, your least favorite band, John from Denver... The least, your least favorite band, Mr. DTs. Uh, when did you finally realize and say, holy shit, that is Robin's footage? There's no question about it. If I showed it to you the first time, you look at it, you didn't see it. Does that mean you don't have, does that mean you don't have the Christ spirit? No, it means... Uh, it means what Jonathan Kleck said. Repeat, intensity, and reversal. Repetitive over and over and over. It will either brainwash you into a lie that someone's trying to prove or cleanse your mind and brainwash your brain into being able to see it. I wish everybody on the planet could see what I'm showing everybody and I also wish upon a star that I can get compensated for it so I don't have to go to work there's, a, there's nothing wrong with that right I wouldn't mind just not having to work for a living that'd be great do what I want all day long unlimited live life like I'm in heaven but that's what this earth is meant to turn into is, but that kind of thing has to connect to the heavenly realm and it has to be able to be tangible evidence for the heavenly court to rule my favor so the physical literal currency can be deposited to my bank and so then you two can get up and come to my house that they built me and sing 
for everybody that I invite. I probably won't invite you, John, from Denver because you don't you don't want to hear them. So I don't, I don't know. When they when they build my house and they're and they come to play, you might change your mind at that time because you know it, it it's different because of the meaning of it. And I'm sure you'll be able to tolerate it at that time because it's live and who doesn't like live music? It doesn't even matter who's playing, really. It's like. But, I don't know, maybe you're not from the band, you two. Maybe you're in a different band, and your arch rival is, is uh, Bono. I mean, it could be. Who knows? I mean, who knows who anybody is that I'm even talking to? It's like fantasy land until it truly becomes real. And this is a step in the right direction on 323 2023. My wife's birthday that Matthew Daly says you sh shouldn't celebrate uh, because God doesn't like that. Look what happened when I celebrated my wife's birthday, Matthew Daly. Huh? Look at that. Look at what happened. A miraculous sign took place in the heavens, in the clouds. Because I would, here's the miracle. The miracle is, it's not, it's not, the miracle isn't that my footage lines up with U2's videos from 39 years ago, which is exact that they took it and used it. That's not the miracle. The miracle is the fact that I even found out that it, that that's what happened. The miracle isn't the X app itself. Although it has something to do with the channeling to in, into the direction to get to the miracle. Finding out what X app. Yeah, of course. But here's the other thing. I asked you for a recommendation of the, of the app. You gave me the recommendation. I used it. However, the app did fail when it was solid as I was testing it beforehand. It failed on both of the videos that I showed. All eight songs, it failed. Jonathan Click is the one that made sure that it wasn't tampered with for good and it was repaired. I forget how I know. I just remember him talking about it in a video and that's what he was referring to. But it doesn't, it's not like, well, you're not, you got nothing to do with those miracles, John from Denver. Um, you, you are a piece of the, the ladder that I use to climb into the next dimension. The, but the true miracle was the fact that when I looked at the video and compared it side by side, that the Holy Spirit deserves the credit for the miracle because the Holy Spirit is what led me into the direction to even go to the art museum in the first place and then to have the idea I want to make my own footage in the art museum and I, I want you to to be my representation of those miracles so as that music isn't your favorite music uh, doesn't need to be your favorite I don't have to make anybody like the music that I like but understand the importance of what it is that day as you can see what it is I don't know if you truly know how it is I think you do and I think you know I think you can see things that I am going to do before I do it as well maybe that's uh, the Holy Spirit maybe it's some kind of sorcery maybe it's uh, who knows what it is as I had my, my box, I was floating it around in the video and you ducked and weaved and bobbed your head back like it was in your way. You know, coincidentally enough, of course, just like everything else, <laughs> but I thought that was pretty funny. Yep. So there, I hope that helps you.